Hey there, paper geeks and glitter nerds, it's Anna the Crazy Geek Crafter. And yes, it is more ornaments for my tree. Now this is quite simple. Uh, I used punches for making all my circles. You could also use dies, or you can cut them by hand if you have uh, minions. You can make them cut them, then they may not be as even, but at least they'll get cut. I made eight pieces per, uh, per ornament, and I'm just going to show you how I did. I'm going to make two red ones, just to top everything off. When you've cut all your eight circles, or more, you fold them all in half. And if there's an up or down to your circle, be aware of that. I had to be aware of that with the ones with writing on them. I had to keep them straight and I wanted all the writing to be uh, the right side up but it took some time but like I said I did it sitting on the couch and watching some Christmas movies then I glue them together in pairs I used the table to uh, get them level I will wait uh, with gluing them together. I have glued all the white ones uh, completely together, so that will be uh, a bit of a challenge to get the string on, but since I didn't put glue down the spine of the ornament, uh, it it will work with the needle and uh, and then putting the, the string in that way. Here I'm trying to make a tassel. I was not very good at it. And in the end, gold tassels with red just reminds me of Chinese New Year, so it, it didn't work for me. But you could make your own tassels, make your minions do it, um, and put them at the bottom of the uh, ornaments. I'll put the red ones away for now. They were frustrating me. So I'm checking that I can get my needle through the center and I'm picking a color of thread. Now these needles I have are uh, especially bought for, for um, yarn or thicker thread. So they have a big eye. But that also means that not too many of my pearls will go on this uh, string, on this needle. I'll need some, uh, some thinner string to play with the, most of the pearls. But I start out trying this uh, bell for stopper and <laughs> accidentally uh, uh, put my needle as a part of the decoration I was not supposed to happen. But I'm just playing around, uh, trying out different things. And that is what this video is mostly about, just me trying things to make ornaments.
now somewhere I think on Pinterest, I'm pretty sure it was Pinterest, I saw ornaments like these made in paper where the edges were gilded or maybe they were hot glued or something, but I figured I'd try it with paint and uh, it's especially good for the uh, uh, the wrapping paper ones, the brown uh, ones with the script on it, because there you can see the core of the paper if I haven't aligned the circles right. It's not as necessary on the white ones because you can't see the difference. It just brought a little bit of shine to uh, the ornaments, and I like that. I am going to experiment with different mediums uh, to put on the uh, edge of the ornaments, though. But it was messy and fiddly, and well, that describes just about every project I ever make, so I guess everything is as normal.
I got the ornaments for my tree and they're looking very nice if I must give an opinion <laughs> of course it's a very colored one but I hope you enjoyed my uh, yuletide projects and that uh, you'll be back when uh, I upload something else this was the uh, last Christmas or holiday projects for this year but I have already got three or four points on my list for next year and until then I'll be making cards and I'll have to return to my haunted house for right now I'll be having a little bit of a holiday, um, I will not be posting on Saturday as I normally do and I'll figure out uh, what to do around New Year's if I'll post on New Year's or if I'll wait on uh, until Saturday. But until next time I hope you'll be having a good day, evening or night. <laughs>